Hi again, everyone, and welcome back to the weekly Mantis Dev Calls. Uh, as we said previously, this is an opportunity for the dev team to go through what they've done in the last week, what they plan to do next week, and to highlight any issues. Um, we're pushing hard to meet the end of November deadline for the release of our testnet. So without further ado, I'll hand over to Nico to get us moving. Thanks, Nico. Uh, hi, guys. So um since last week uh, first we we're doing some progress on the treasury sport on that we completed the whole flow and only have uh, some missing uh, protocol changes that uh, are already on review and advanced review and maybe should probably be immersed soon uh, on other ecp that we were implementing the two pointing uh, we are still uh, doing progress in in order to uh, implement the required support uh, on the Mantis side. Uh, that uh, we expect that to have at least an initial version, uh, maybe this week, uh, ne next week, if not. Um, uh, apart from that, we've been doing some progress on uh, bumping several versions of the OBFT dependencies. Uh, that uh, was in progress and now, now it's completed. And after that, we are uh, moving on to uh, planning our next release iteration and also integrating uh, the OEFT nodes into our clusters so as to be able to uh, yeah, not, not only have the, the current nodes that we have, but also maybe some uh, introduced to point into it uh, eventually once we uh, we have uh, a Mantis only doesn't up and running. Uh, on this, probably Mirko will uh, give a more up updates. Hey, I'm Mirko. I'm also a, a core developer on the Mantis uh, team. And regarding the testnet, our plan is to have a, a working experimental environment with uh, both ACPs implemented and start uh, testing uh, about it. Currently, we are deploying this in a cluster using some uh, stuff from the IOHK DevOps team. And hopefully, next week or in the next weeks, are going to show you something about the metrics and, uh, and the status of, of this test and the purpose. But now we are pushing hard to, to have it working. Now we can pass through Conrad. Hi, everyone. So uh, status of the syncing networking work. Uh, first of all, our full node, which we are running on EC2 instance to check if Mantis is compatible with uh, ETC, has reached the top without any consensus issue. And it is following the tip of the main, main net for the last like a week and a half. So there is, so we can say that we are totally compatible with uh, ETC, with all the latest forks and uh, the regular syncing is uh, stable enough to be used when syncing with the mainnet. Um, another um, kind of uh, branch of work is improving our fast sync because currently it's not regular enough, uh, not reliable enough. Uh, the one first pull request which improve our um, target block selection algorithm has been merged, and the first PR with a uh, big bunch of improvement to state synchronization is in review, so it should be merged soon. Uh, on network side, we are progressing with uh, adapting our existing Kadimlia um, work to the uh, format of Ethereum. So um, it's la larger work stream and still it's work in progress. Um, yeah, that's all from my side. Hi. Um, hi there, Andre here, I'm a Wallet Squad captain. Um, so in uh, last week, um, the biggest uh, thing that uh, is uh, delivered is an address book functionality. So it is uh, much easier to know uh, to 
who and from where uh, ITER is uh, being transferred. Um, besides that there is a bunch of uh, smaller UX and uh, UI improvements as well as there is ongoing work uh, on ability to switch uh, networks while the wallet is uh, running so it is much more convenient for a uh, user to, to use different uh, networks and, uh, and not to have to do some any configuration uh, magic and uh, that's it for us Um, hello, everyone. Uh, this is Sergey speaking. Uh, I will give you a brief update of the uh, QA team. So uh, during previous week, we uh, finished it with the Luna Wallet uh, test cases, and uh, we delivered the Docker-based environment deployer, uh, which allow us to spin up the uh, networks with different configurations. Uh, speaking of the tasks that are in progress, uh, we currently approaching finish. We are finalizing the uh, network activities generator right now, uh, and working on the treasury uh, test cases. And uh, during uh, upcoming weeks, we are going to focus our forces on the uh, checkpointing side, mainly creating the test cases. Uh, also, we if time will allow us we are going to um, we're going to create and provide description of the general node test cases including uh, syncing discovery if we will be available uh, transaction processing mining etc uh, and uh, <clears throat> also if uh, some functionality will be available we are going to uh, perform the fast syncing reliability testing uh, as well as the some initial uh, network uh, load or stress testing. Um, and also, if uh, time will allow, we would like to um, we would like to run a complete suite of the automated regression test cases at least on uh, our local environment if uh, if not as part of the some kind of nightly builds. And I think this is pretty much it. Passing back to you, Dave. Great. Thanks, uh, Sergey, and thanks, everybody. And um, you can see things are moving fast. As always, you can you can catch us on our GitHub repo to, to see what's going on. Um, and until then, we'll see you next week. Thanks, everybody. Bye.